It's a once-in-a-lifetime event for many of us will occur on August 21st with a total solar eclipse. And John, of course, extremely interested as John a meteorologist. And Linda, and Linda gets to go along for the <laughs> yeah. ride. You've brought some things to show us, and we'll get yeah. to those in just a minute. But here's something that I've learned that's so cool. So think about it. If you're traveling on an airplane, some of the flights are going to literally pass right by the eclipse. So Southwest has identified five flights. They're headed into Nashville that will offer maximum effects of viewing the solar eclipse. They will see the moon momentarily blot out the sun, and there will be commemorative swag given on these oh, wow. flights. They're doing flares and cosmic cocktails. As of Friday, there were still seats on some of wow. these flights. None of them are coming from Tampa, but uh -huh. you know, there are people that will, like the Denver to Nashville route goes right along that midsection of the country. That's amazing. Where Just you're going to be able to eclipse. see. Isn't that neat? That is so cool. I, I mean, instead of, you know, eight, ten minutes of eclipse, you're going to have Hours. And a couple hours. Wow. I know. Isn't that neat? So oh, I want a ticket. Fingers <laughs> crossed the weather cooperates. But tell us yeah. some of the things that you're okay. doing that we can do. Well, what, have you, what are you thinking? Yeah, you know, I thought a lot of us are not going to be traveling to see the eclipse. And most of us will be staying here at home. And we'll get about an 80% eclipse here. Which so it's pretty good. Yes, not it's bad. something to see. Um, it's You don't need big telescopes to see the eclipse. The naked eye will do it just fine if you have proper protection for your eyes. And that is a big, big important if. You have to have that. Uh, and binoculars will be a great thing as well. Most people don't know that on the bottom of the binocular is a little cap that unscrews. And what that will do will be to reveal a little bolt hole there that will accommodate a tripod holder. So instead of having to hold the binoculars up for a prolonged period of time, and by the way, only do this if you have the proper solar filters for your binoculars. Yeah, you have to protect yeah. the binocular lenses like you protect your eyes. You can burn your eyes so badly. You oh, absolutely no. can. But they make special binoculars for solar viewing, uh -huh. or you can get the filters that are necessary for use using your binoculars. So this is just a little mini tripod. But pretend you had a big tripod. They make a little adapter, and these little adapters are... You know, about five bucks, that's about it on Amazon. Screws right into the, your tripod, or you can get a monopod, which is even cooler, I think, for about 10 or 15 bucks at uh, oh, any of the that. department stores. That was cool. And then this just holds it right there, so you don't have to hold those binoculars up for, you know, five, six minutes. So that's easy, and that's fun, and that's simple to do, and not very expensive. Also, even less expensive is get a big white sheet of paper, and I showed some things on last time I was on about how to view the eclipse, but this is so simple. You just take a pencil, and in the middle of the paper, you poke a little hole. And with that little hole in the middle of the, there you go, you just hold it up to the sun as the eclipse passes by, and it will project onto the ground a beautiful image of the eclipse. That Even you can, with that little hole? That little hole. And it'll, it'll make the, uh, uh, about that big on the ground, make the image of the sun, and you'll well, be able to watch idea. the moon cross right over it. Simple, oh, wow. cheap, easy. All right, now tell and us about the app. Finally, and I love this. This has just come out in the last couple of weeks. This is produced by NASA that has a, um, an app that you can get on your Android or Apple phone to allow you to become a citizen observer of the eclipse anywhere Anywhere. You don't have to be right in the totality in that narrow little 60-mile path that goes across the United States. Anywhere in the United States you can add valuable information right into this app, which will go to NASA and help scientists wow. study this eclipse. And I have it yeah, on, it's up on, here the, on the, the big screen behind me, the uh, output from our phone. And the Solar Observer app gives you instructions on how to view the eclipse, how to oh, view wow. clouds, oh, all kinds nice. of things. Also some mosquito tips, oddly enough. I don't know why that's on there, but they decided to do that. But the eclipse, you log on with a... Um, with your uh, email account, right. and uh, you make an a, a, uh, account that will and record your observations. Oh, cool. It gives you great information about cloud cover, the kind of clouds that you may have in your neighborhood, how to take the air temperature during the time of the eclipse, how to take the surface temperature of the soil at the wow. time of the eclipse, and bunches of other variables. So for very little money, you can use this app and give NASA some very important information. All of Great way things. to get the kids involved. And I know you just mentioned like the air temperature and the soil. All of those things are going to be affected because for whatever that time is, yes. the sun is not warming anything. In, in totality, when you're in the total eclipse of the sun in the uh, moon shadow, you'll probably experience a 10, maybe 12 degree drop in the air temperature. We'll take wow. it. <laughs> Locally, probably four or five degrees.
but Very still interesting. significant. All right, remember, this is all coming up August 21st. Of course, we'll continue talking about it. And John has an amazing Facebook page that yes. you can follow as well. We're, We're going to go uh, Facebook Live, I think. During the, uh, <laughs> yes. Good. John and Linda are hitting the road to see it in yeah. its totality. Yeah. But for yes. those of us seeing it here, we will obviously we'll live vicariously through John. be posting yeah. and it's talking. It's going to be exciting. All right.